Stephen, what's your um, assessment of the evening overall, first of all? Well, unfortunately, not very good because we've not got two points that we wanted to come and get. So, um, yeah, credit to Yorkshire. I thought they batted really well. Um, Finn Allen started it off with a couple of nice blows. Uh, Dave Willey, I thought, played well. Harry Brook looks in the form of his life. Uh, and and Tattersall played really well at the end. So, you know, probably probably a few over par, but, you know, we thought it was a decent wicket and boundaries that were very reachable. So, um, yeah, obviously disappointed. We, we look at it and, you know, losing four weeks in a power play, you've, you're not going to win many games, but... You know, we're taking the positive option and we lost wickets. Um, that's the way we play, but obviously we're going to have to be better. Um, uh, and obviously we need to dust ourselves off. Now we've got a few days before Leicester on Friday. Personally for you, it was a career best in the T20 format and a productive partnership with Dan Christian. What was your mindset going in uh, when that partnership began at five down today? Well, just to rebuild really and build partnerships and play. You know, it felt like, uh, you know, a wicket. If you bowled like back of a length and straight, it was quite hard. But if you missed, you could score quite, uh, quite quickly and quite easily. So... You know, wait for balls in my area. You always have to take a few risks every now and then uh, and pick your bowlers. But, you know, myself and Dan, when it was around 13 over, felt that it was well within our grasp. But, you know, credit to Willie and Drakes at the end. I thought they, and Thompson, to be fair, I thought they bowled quite three very important and good overs. And, you know, that's probably what, what was the difference in the end. In what's already proven quite a tight North group, is, is net run rate a consideration as well on a chase like that? Yeah, absolutely. I think you see Matt there at the end trying to hit every ball for six. Um, yeah, it is. But as you said, everyone's beating everybody. So I think, you know, I think we're probably four, two to four points out of the four, out of the qualification. So, you know, we've got to, we've got to play teams above and below us quite a few times. So if we can pick up points, I'm sure we'll be there or thereabouts. And it seemed like an innings that demanded a bit of creativity at times, plenty of boundaries down to third man, as well as some of the bigger blows today. Was that something you were, you were conscious of doing to keep the scoreboard? Not ticking? really, no. Obviously, I tried to sweat Revis once that was premeditated. But apart from that, it was just probably stand still and, and let natural instinct take over. And uh, as for the performance with the ball, the middle overs, there was that period of uh, sort of constriction from the, the three spinners. How, how important was that in terms of bringing it back to a totally could yeah, try and attack? Yeah, I thought Calvin, Summit and Carts obviously were, were magnificent in the middle uh, and Carts in the power play again. You know, we've got, I think we got it for, for quite a few sixes, which obviously we, uh, we pride ourselves on. But, you know, at the end of the day, they played very well uh, and we played OK. So they, they deserve the win tonight.